Well, in this video, I'm going to show you how to get to GeoGebra's probability calculator. First thing we do is get to GeoGebra. Just Google GeoGebra or to GeoGebra.org. And uh, there used to be a link right down here that said probability and a probability calculator. Uh, it is now gone, unfortunately. Uh, hopefully, GeoGebra will bring that back. But I think the best way to still get that, they still have it available. There's just not a link to it. You want to click on GeoGebra Classic. So click on GeoGebra Classic. And here on the right, you'll see a probability pop up as an option. There we go. Another way to get to that is if you click the uh, menu bar up here, the three uh, horizontal lines, get to the menu, move that down, there's the view button. And you have all these options here. Uh, and then for our class, we just need probability. So you probably saw, you know, the algebra setup. I don't, we won't need that for statistics. If you just want probability calculator, make sure this is checked. And I could do algebra and graphics. That's kind of the main setup. So make sure you got probability calculator checked. It's under the view tab. So once again, how do we get here? Oh, the page. Go to the main GeoGebra uh, website, click on GeoGebra Classic. Uh, if you see this little side menu open up, click on Probability, that'll work. Or click on the, the menu down here. Click the menu down, click on View, and you want to see Probability Calculator. So click on that. And if anything else is clicked, again, for statistics, you don't need it. You just need Probability Calculator. And then what you'll need for this class is a binomial theorem could come up or click on the statistics tab right here and you have all your statistic tests and then goodness of fit and chi-squared test of association. 